Like the calm before the storm, all major thoroughfares and expressways leading to and from cemeteries and final resting places are rather quiet and not as busy as they were a few days prior. But authorities, especially the PNP, are well aware that the situation will definitely change once our countrymen decide to head back to the urban jungle after their respective Undas exodus. Rod Lagusad tells us more. The Philippine National Police will remain on heightened alert until Monday, November 6, for the expected surge of travelers coming back to the metropolis. PNP spokesperson Colonel Jean Pardo said that police assistance desks set up in airports, seaports, and bus terminals will also remain until Monday. Kaya ang paalala po natin ay uh, sa ating mga kababayan na kung kayo po ay babiyahe, mas maigi po na na pumunta po kayo ng maaga sa mga pier at terminal para hindi po kayo uh, uh, masama po doon at makaiwas sa siksikan ng tao. At ingatan niyo po ang inyong mga gamit, ang inyong mga, inyong mga batang maliliit na kasama. She added that motorists should ensure their vehicles are in good running condition to avoid any untoward incidents. The North Luzon Expressway is also bracing for more motorists coming back to Metro Manila. Ang inaasahan natin dagsaan na pagbalik ng ating mga babayan ay uh, Sunday pa rin na uh, hapon hanggang gabi at maging uh, early morning ng Monday. Tinitingnan po natin na uh, maaari ganun yung volume po medyo mas mataas konti kasi uh, nung pauwi po sila maaari hindi po sila nagkasabay-sabay ano po. pero itong balikan dahil uh, meron ng pasok sa Monday uh, Maaring, uh, mas po yung Because of this, the NLEX Tollways Management advises motorists to check the traffic situation on NLEX before traveling to avoid possible heavy traffic situations. Ignatius stressed they are ready with enough personnel for this surge and can implement counterflow schemes if need be. Zambales bound traveler Jana is already considering her strategy in her return trip for home. So baka pinag-iisipan ko pa kung baka Monday na lang ako ng madaling araw or siguro kung pipilitin wala magtsatsaga nila sa traffic siguro on Sunday. Meanwhile, the dry run for the full implementation of RFIDs on all NLEX toll plaza started on October 25 and will continue until December 31. With the designated lanes in place for the continued installation of RFID stickers, NLEX hopes this will help reduce long queues in cash lanes. Rod Lugusad, for the nation.